So at YouTube, today I was back with a shoulders, legs and abs workout. I began the workout with seated dumbbell shoulder press. Nothing too crazy, just warming it up. 20k each side, stuck to around 10 to 12 reps today. I didn't go to failure or anything like that. I just kept it within that rep range. Uh, just trying to like confuse my body so I'm not doing the same thing all the time. On to my second set, this is with the 24s. Felt nice and light, uh, just building up to my fourth final heavy set. Uh, trying to get a nice good feel for the muscle, keep constant tension on. Actually, um, trying to lean forward a bit more to keep the tension on my shoulder muscles as much as possible. Because uh, I do have a tendency to lean back a bit too much sometimes. So I want to definitely improve on that with my form. Uh, on to, this is on to my third set, 28k, day, 28k dumbbells. If I was going to fail, I usually get about 15, 16, but I stopped at about 12. Uh, it felt nice and light, nothing too drastic to be honest. And here we go, this is me fourth and heavy set. This is with the 32s and uh, I'm not going to lie, I was really pleased with this. I can't really ask for too much more. Um, you, Me PR in the past has been eight reps, whereas today it was nine reps and I'm really pleased about that. Um, just in time, I am gradually progressing on this exercise and you can't ask for, I couldn't really ask for too much more than that to be honest. So I'm really pleased about that. That's a new PR for me. I then moved on to leg press. Now with leg press, instead of warming up with 325s and a 5, I went a bit heavier today. Uh, I threw a 2.5 on each side and I got between 13 reps. Oh, I think going to failure on leg press, I'd never advise anyone to do unless you've got people around you because it is pretty dangerous. So I think if I was going to failure, I'd probably get about 15, but I, st I, stuck about, I stopped two reps before failure and got about 13 reps. Uh, then on to my second set, this is with, I threw a 10 on, so it's an extra 2.5 basically. Um, I got about 10 to 11 reps, which I'm happy about. I mean, I don't want to go um, too, too heavy on leg press, but as long as it's around the 8 rep mark, no lower than that, because obviously, you know, end of the day, I don't want it to be too much dan too dangerous. Um, this is my third and final set. It felt pretty heavy, but at the end of the day, I got the job done. I got, I think I got about nine reps, so in total it was 13 reps, then 11, then nine. Uh, so I'm pretty happy with that. Didn't progress, didn't fall, just kept the same really. Uh, then on to see, uh, seated hammer strength shoulder press. First set, just the plate warming it up, again around 12 reps. Second set, through a 10 on. Um, a similar, again, I think I might have got 11 reps on that. Um, a third set, two plates. It felt pretty light, two plates today, to be honest. I'm, I managed to knock out, I think it was about 13 reps, I got an extra rep, uh, trying to keep constant tension on my shoulder muscles. I really like this machine, to be honest. I think it's a bit underrated, um, to be honest. I, I really do like it. I think it's great for me, definitely my shoulders. It's, it's brilliant for it. Uh, this is me heavy set. Me, I think I've got nine reps on this. This might, uh, usually I, I only just about get eight, but I actually got nine, so I was really happy about that. It's just like, it's only a rep, isn't it? But for me, it's a big deal. Uh, you know, it's a rep more than where I was last time, so I'm pleased with that. Uh, then I moved on to hamstring curls. We thought I definitely need to improve my form on this, but this was about, I think, 15 to 17 reps. I can't remember the weight exactly. They do vary in gyms. It was about third off the stack, which is nothing to brag about by any means, but it's just to give you an idea of what weight I'm up to on this. I think this was the first set. I didn't want to really upload too much footage because it's a bit boring, isn't it, watching someone do hamstring curls, especially from a bit of a distance, so... And then I moved on to a standing side lateral raises. Now, I didn't go as light today. I just jumped in to about 20 pounds and did about 15 to 20 reps. In the past, I've been doing the first set about nearly 30, 32 reps. But I wanted to go a bit heavier today to change things up. Uh, I am progressing with a standing lateral Standing side lateral raises. I, I, I would advise you to actually give it a go. If you've never actually, if you've never done it before, it is so much harder compared to seated. It, it's not. It, it's drastically harder. But at the end of the day, I'd rather do the harder exercises. Uh, get more benefit out of it. Um. Yeah. Again, similar weight on this. Nothing. Uh, not too light. Uh. Just kind of jump straight in. To be honest, I only did two sets in the past. I've been doing three, but just wanted to do two because I'm training early again tomorrow before um, United play West Ham and going that tomorrow, so don't particularly want to burn myself out too drastically. Um, and this is the end of my first set. Yeah. Then this is my last set of it. Uh, this is on about £25. I've got about 11 reps, which is an improvement, but 
I think, obviously, because I didn't do the first set for about 30 reps, I'm, I was stronger. I wasn't as fatigued coming to this, so that's why I managed to get more reps in on this. So as you can see, it was still very difficult, like, as you can tell by my face, like, trying to squeeze out the last few reps, and I got it done, which is the main thing. Again, this side, um, I think it was about 10 or 11 reps, somewhere around there. It felt pretty good. The lighting can be pretty good in here, too, so <laughs> that's always a bonus when you're uploading footage. Um, there we go. I think that's 10... Then 11, oh that might, might be one off there, this is 11 sorry, <laughs> just trying to get the final rep out. And then I finished off with some uh, seated uh, ab crunches, great for the abs, uh, it's hard to, when, you'll know what I mean when you're doing this, there's a certain range of motion on this where you feel your abs almost perfectly contract and you'll know what I mean when you're doing it. So I thought this was the first set for about 30 odd reps, second set I got about 20 but I didn't want to upload it because a bit like the hamstring curls, it's a bit boring isn't it watching someone do this. Um, but yeah, I'll be back uh, with more workout footage tomorrow. I think it'll be chest and back. Might do a bit more on arms as, as well tomorrow. So 